the honey bee, a tiny hero in a big world. Honeybees are the most important pollinators. Pollinating almost a hundred crops. Making it the most fruitful job in the world. But without them, life as we know it will end. And bees are in trouble. In recent years, millions of bee colonies have been lost all around the world. Besides their natural enemies like birds or parasites, bees must deal with new dangers. Pesticides, low nutrition and viruses, which all weaken our natural pollinators. So listen to our story of the bee hero. To see how even the smallest life can matter. And be the change. Oh right, guys, well, welcome to Bee Simulator. Now, you might notice a couple different things compared to some of our other videos. Uh, one, let's do a roll call. Nathan? Here. Shane? Shane's not here. This is uh, my first solo video, and hopefully I can continue making some of these. Should be kind of a lot of fun. But then also, you might notice that there is a webcam now. So unfortunately you guys get to see my hideous face and I apologize for the probably hundreds of thousands of phones and computer screens that have just shattered now from looking at this. But I am super excited for Bee Simulator. I know nothing about it. I came across it a long time ago and I said this would be the first game that I'm gonna record and do all this stuff with. So, let's jump in. By the way, it was a very touching introduction, if I say so myself. Pick a profile. Uh, you know what? Hmm. Let's just go with easy so we can enjoy it a little bit. And of course, you gotta do B. Let's go. I also love the random facts about the bees in between everything. And in case you haven't noticed, this kind of continues on with our lovely bug theme videos that we keep putting out. I personally have a soft spot for all all things creepy crawly. Kind of like a wannabe entomologist here, so this should be tons of fun. I'm a baby bee apparently. Oh, look at my little arms. So cute. I would say it's that mom and dad, but that's not how bee society works. It's like one queen and all these workers. I'm trying. Oh, jeez. Not gonna lie. Kind of adorable. I look very confused, which is probably how this entire game is gonna go. We go some foreshadow. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, a new hatchling. Hi, little one. What's your name? Oh, jeez. They talk. <laughs> Biscuit. That's funny. Uh, let's see here. Do -do -do. Great. Well, first things first. Appreciate that. I can use that. Alright, let's do it. How do I fly? Forward, back, left, right, up, downs. Alright. Some interesting things about... Oh, jeez. Sorry for just getting everybody's motion sickness there. I am not the best flyer when it comes to video games. 
Uh, I'm sure Shane can attest to that. We've played many of games where we just fly helicopters and all that fun jazz, and I literally crash within the first five seconds. All right, follow the good markers. All right, let's go. It's a very pretty game. I like the little B models. We have a special place where you can learn how to be a bee. Just like this crack. That sounds sketchy. So this is why I was excited for this game, because it's... You bloody... You're a bee. And you're cute. Adorable. It's other... Obviously you're going to interact with other insects, so I'm kind of cu um, curious to see how that's going to work out as well. Oh, that was a little... What is it? Where are you? Oh, it's a blue tongue skink! Oh! Hey, he's cute. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Oh. Everybody's the buzz. Everybody's excited for like you know, um, what was it Zoo Planet that just came out not too long ago? No, no, this is jeez, drunk to be. I'm sorry. This is where it's at. Beast Simulator. We got some butterflies. Oh jeez, spider webs, spider webs. I'm assuming I can get stuck in them and die. What is that? Stag beetle. Hi. Are we gonna fight? No? He's cool. There's a spider up here. Oh. See, this is cool. This. I'm sad I don't get stuck to this web, but I'm guessing that'd be like a future problem, not a current problem. But look at that. Ah! There's a snail! Hey, snail. Alright. To be a real bee, you must learn to collect pollen. Alright. Let's go do bee things. So this is where you're gonna notice my um flying skills suck. It's not too oh jeez. You night Oh, grasshopper! Ah, jeez. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, oh that's cool. Those are almost like logger, green logger ones. A couple frogs. There's another grasshopper. So some rocks. That's not as exciting. Is this the hive? Oh, this is where we can put like honey in the junk. I wonder if everybody's like out there, like has actually seen like a huge beehive like that. It was a dragonfly. Because I know where I work, there's a giant beehive in the back that we just kind of like stare at, and we just don't go anywhere near it. And it's kind of cool, cool. We go back and watch all the bees going in and out. But I don't know if you ever like, I now around my house, I never see any kind of like large bees floating around. Sadly. Oh my gosh, that's dangerous. This is where I die. Also, can you die? Like, how does this work? Like, if I die, am I gonna be like reborn as a new bee? Uh, here we go. It also seems like these checkpoints respawn, so that's good. Oh no! Sorry. Get yeah, sorry. 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 There we go. Look at that. I got bees. All right. Oh, that's interesting. B vision. Oh, I'm sorry, I'll pretty much go first person. So our collect four epic pollens. What's considered epic? I guess that's considered epic. So red. Yeah. What makes these plants epic? It's just they're different, they're rare. So many questions. Oh, 
Hi, Dragonflies. Ah, uh, this is so much fun. Great work, little sister. And now you're full of Beatro. <laughs> we use Beatro as a power up to fly faster. Try it Ooh. out. Feel like a rocket. So this is where I, I immediately crash and kill myself. So this. Yep. There you go. That wasn't too bad. Oops. Ooh, jeez. Oh, 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 oh. I'm sorry, B. Wowzers. That was Wowzers. Fast. Okay, one last thing. A proper B knows how to deposit her collected pollen. A proper B. Maybe, maybe, maybe. All right, teach me how to do this. I just crash into it. Oh, you automatically drop off falling. Oh, okay. So, oh yeah, I literally just crash into it. That was too bad. Go back to Alice. Fantastic! You're all set now. Follow the tunnel to return to the hive. All right. Back to the hive. Is it? Wait, is this the right tunnel? Oh, that tunnel. Woo! Mushrooms! I do plan on probably keeping in all of these cutscenes because I feel like they are very important and a lot of fun information about bees in general. Because no bees are awesome. Unless the cutscene takes, the loading screen takes like 30 minutes to load, then I might have to do some fancy editing. There we go. Hello? <gasps> I know all the basics. I get to meet the queen? My new tasks. I'm not ready. I should visit mom. I'm unworthy. Well, you must be very eager to get to work. Oh wait, you're not the queen. But I don't know what I should be doing. I apparently have a voice as well. I get to choose my job? What? Oh no, silly. The queen decides. You must go see her. Go the marker or show me the way. So, I this is curious. I wonder if I get to like answer some questions or if it just like I become like a bee of all trades and I do a little bit of everything. Like answer some questions based on my answers, be what kind of job I want to do. This is also a giant hive. These bees. This lazy one. What are you doing? Hey, keeping busy. <laughs> okay. I was. I should get like a a bee pun counter for each one I come across. I might do that. Throw down a bomb corner. Like bam. I'm drunk or super nervous. Oh no. Why do you approach our queen? Hush, my guards. Let my newest child approach me. <laughs> well, little one, you are a honeybee now. Fly forth into the world. Collect pollen for the hive. Oh, I'm gonna get to like actually choose. She just tells me. Okay, that was kind of sad. I'm stuck. Oh, that's a cool picture. Can I get that as like a wallpaper for my computer? Three simple ones. Simple eyes just kind of like see shadows and stuff. Is, there a dragon? is that a deer? Why is there a deer in someone's 
backyard. Am I in a zoo? Am I in New York? Oh. Okay. Bleep. Yeah. The Grand Central Park or whatever. Yeah, I mean... Look at that. Worlds collide. I believe Planet Zoo came out and now Zoo Simulator. I'm a bee within the game, within the bee game. Ooh. Those was like bean bees. Whoa. Talk oh. about traffic. I need to be more careful. All right. Let's gather some pollen. Can we fly forward? Thank you. Yeah, FYI, I am trying my best to keep this flight as smooth as possible. Uh, oh, person! Alright, so this should be interesting. Let's see what this person does. I feel like I'm in Sims. Hey! Hey! I mean you. We are one. Psst. Psst. You have nice hair. I like your hair. I can see up your nose. This guy is either super blind or has no fear of bees. Because I'm like literally up his nose. Alright. Keep it nice and simple. Don't do anything crazy. There we go. <laughs> yeah. I'm either in... I'm either a bee within Planet Zoo, or I'm a bee within The Sims. Because that's what it feels like. Based on how everybody's talking with their made-up Sims language. Oh, use bee vision. Okay. Oh, that's right. The rare ones were red, weren't they? Ow! Okay, that's not a rare one. Oh, yeah. One more, one more. There we go. Oh, there is a bee over there. And she doesn't look well. <gasps> Sick bee. I should okay. see if I can help her. I'm coming. Hello, are you all right? Do you need help getting back to the hive? Oh, what? Sick bee, Jackie. I don't feel so good. Oh no. Everything is spinning. She's drunk. You leave me alone. Wait. Oh no. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? Oh, there she is. <laughs> yeah, sorry. I, I'm so sorry. I am. Try my best. Oh dear. Oh no. Random floating spider web. That was, that was weird. Ah! Am I supposed to. Oh, fudge. I missed that one. Oh, I think those are flies, actually. To be honest with you. Oh, jeez. What is that? Ooh. 
Uh oh. Wasp Avery. Oh, I didn't do anything. You will pay for disturbing my meal. I didn't do anything. We'll see. Don't fight him. Oh man. An indicator is in blue. Push this. Block me in red. <laughs> so let's play Dance Dance Revolution. Ooh, ooh. Now I'm not gonna lie. If I was having a picnic and I saw like a hornet and a bee fight like this, I would just sit there and watch and be amazed. Like, oh, he's not dead yet. Seriously. There we go. Ooh, finish him! Oh, no fatalities. That'd be kind of cool. Nope, just came away. That's it for me. But just you wait. Oh, great. Hey, it's safe to come out now. You can go home. Piece of a rotten apple. Mm, yep. She it's, was drunk. Really funny. Oh, drunk B. I feel so sick. Great. Don't worry. They'll help you back in the hive. We're all family after all. <sighs> Thank you. That's a good day's work. Oh, wow. To go home. Ow. Oh, fudge. Wait, no, I want some of this cake. What was it? Oh. oh I can walk around! Okay. Where's the hive at? Hey, mister. Wow, I have so much pollen. Before I gather more, I have to take this stuff back to the hive. Can I... There we go. We. Ooh, it's right a needle. Ow, did did didn't do it. Um close before what do they want with our tree you can cut down our tree hey hey what are you doing you no know, if you move your mouth a bit you actually might be able to understand you a little bit more ow fudge See yet again. That's another really cool screenshot. Uh, the honeybee's wings flap incredibly fast, so about 200 beats per minute. What? One second. Five per minute. Is that the queen? Search for a new place for us to live. 
As for the rest, get back to your duties. Hmm. So my scout. Do I have to go find you home? We are family. Oh look at a little family tree. Okay, fine. I'm gonna go drop this pollen off. Back to work. We still need more epic pollen for the winter. But epic pollen is hard to find. It may be time to visit our library. Alright, well on that note, I think I'm going to end right here. Looking out into our little busy bees. Yeah, let's put that in that little counter too. And we'll see what happens next time. So it looks like we have to go find a new home and continue finding pollen for the winter. So do we survive the winter? Do we have to find a new home before the winter? What were those unknown speaking humans have to say? Find out next time. Alright guys.